clomiphene, also known by the brand name Clomid, is commonly used to increase testosterone. But did you know there's a newer and better alternative? In this video, we'll talk about the lesser known facts about clomiphene and why another drug, n clomiphene is the superior choice. Though clomiphene is often used by men looking to increase their testosterone levels, the drug's original FDA approval in 1967 is to improve women's fertility and has been used off-label in men as well. Clomiphene is actually made up of two different isomers or mirror molecules. 62% of it is N-clomiphene and 38% of it is another compound called Zooclomiphene. And these two compounds work in very different ways. Zooclomiphene is an estrogen agonist, meaning it mimics the effects of estrogen in the body, while N-clomiphene is an estrogen antagonist, meaning it blocks the effects of estrogen from binding to the estrogen receptors. When clomiphene is used for the purpose of increasing testosterone levels, the research shows that the N-clomiphene isomer is mostly responsible for the testosterone-boosting effects, while the Zooclomiphene isomer contributes very little to the intended outcomes. Enclomiphene works by blocking estrogen from exhibiting feedback at the receptor level in the hypothalamus and pituitary gland, which then increases the LH signal to your testes to produce more testosterone. This is why enclomiphene can, and we argue should, be isolated to be taken without zooclomiphene. While both clomiphene and enclomiphene are safe alternatives to TRT in terms of their ability to preserve your fertility and protect your body's ability to produce its own natural testosterone, clomiphene carries more extensive side effects, which is believed to be due to the presence of zooclomiphene, which lingers in the body far more than enclomiphene. And clomiphene's half-life is about 10 and a half hours, while zooclomiphene's half-life is much longer, around 30 days. What this means is if you take clomiphene, most people will experience an increase in testosterone and mood, libido, and energy, but on average, after 10 and a half hours, enclomiphene will be 50% gone from your system, and will only remain in small amounts, if at all, after 24 hours, leaving zooclomiphene, the estrogen agonist, active in your system. In fact, after six weeks of starting clomiphene treatment, the initial 2 to 3 ratio of zooclomiphene to enclomiphene becomes 20 to 1 in favor of zooclomiphene. As a result, as you continue to take clomiphene, the estrogenic side effects of zooclomiphene become more and more apparent. While clomiphene works well to increase testosterone levels, n clomiphene is far more potent on a milligram basis. Head-to-head -head research studies show that while both do a good job of increasing testosterone, n clomiphene does a better job at increasing LH, FSH, and sperm count. n clomiphene also did not exhibit as much of an increase in estradiol or estrogen and had lower incidences of overall side effects, including decreased energy, libido, and mood. There were also no reports of ocular or vision changes with enclomiphene, which is a rare but reversible side effect with clomiphene. In real-world clinical practice across thousands of patients, ocular side effects have not been noted with any regularity, and anecdotal mentions of this on social media are most likely due to illegal sources deceptively selling clomiphene as enclomiphene. Overall, clomiphene is generally well tolerated, and given its relatively short half-life, dosages can be adjusted easily to maximize benefits while minimizing potential side effects. Alright, if you've reached this part of the video and you're someone who cares about their health, you can subscribe to our free newsletter using the link provided in the description below. Each week, our team provides practical, evidence-based tips to optimize your health and performance. As a thank you, you'll also get my free ebook which outlines ways to naturally optimize your hormonal health. Then clomiphene may be right for you if you're exhibiting signs of low testosterone, like low energy or fatigue, low mood or irritability, low libido or erectile dysfunction, and decreased motivation and drive. In addition to reducing these symptoms, the data also promisingly suggests that increasing testosterone significantly improves work and athletic performance and increases happiness and life enjoyment. If this sounds like something you can benefit from and you qualify, and clomiphene can be a relatively safe way of increasing your testosterone and vitality. If you're intrigued by the potential benefits of enclomiphene, be sure to check out Maximus's testosterone protocol for a comprehensive approach to optimizing your testosterone levels. Head over to MaximusTribe.com to see if you qualify. We'll connect you with a licensed doctor who, if approved, can provide you with a personalized dosage of medication and monitor your testosterone levels and function over time. In combination with optimizing lifestyle habits like sleep, exercise, nutrition, focus, and social support, and clomiphene can help you maximize your natural levels of testosterone and have you feeling your best.